Well, Felsted is very definitely a boarding school, with boarding pupils living in eight out of our ten senior school houses. The structure of our week and the way that we plan our days is based around our boarding pupils, who make up over 70% of our pupil community here. This can be clearly seen at the weekends, when we have lessons on Saturday mornings, sports training or matches for everyone after lunch, and then our 120 or so traditional boarders enjoy a relaxing and slightly quieter pace on Saturday evening and Sunday, before many of their peers return on a Sunday evening for the start of the next week. It's true that the school has a slower pace on a Sunday, but the students really do appreciate that. They like it. There are still plenty of people around with activities happening on site, so swimming or the Sunday coffee club, and off site as well, with trips perhaps to Cambridge or even to London for those who wish to participate. We're very much a boarding school. So our aim in the boarding houses is to build a community with the feel of a family. New pupils will join either a boys' or a girls' house where they'll quickly get to know the two or three house staff who live in the building and who look after them. These staff are there day and night to help and support every person in the house, to do their best to make sure that they are happy at school, building friendships, involved in lots of activities and making progress in their work. The house staff will work closely with the subject teachers and will be in touch with you or the child's parents either through email or by phone to help you know that everything is going okay or to talk about the challenges that might come up. It's so important to us that you know how they are doing. So there's no sense in which parents bring or send their child to Felstead and then simply leave them in our care. We've worked to ensure that parents are aware of all that is going on. So whether that's through reports or newsletters, communications from boarding or academic staff, parents and guardians can see a whole host of information and feedback by logging into our parent information system. Now, each evening in the boarding houses, other members of staff come in to help supervise our evening study time. Now, this is the quiet period, when pupils are in their own rooms completing their independent work that's been set by their academic teachers. Those staff are around to supervise and help as well, if it's needed. But in our houses, we want all our pupils to build good friendships. We work hard to create a good mix of different nationalities in each boarding house. And we have buddy systems so that our new pupils have one or two peers that will give them particular support right from the very start. And this might be someone in their own year or perhaps an older pupil and might often be someone of the same nationality. The younger students are very likely to be in shared rooms in their houses and our year 12 or 13, our sixth form, normally in single rooms. But they'll spend lots of time uh, with their friends in lessons and activities or relaxing in their house and there's plenty of opportunity as well to visit their friends that they make in other boarding houses too. We'd expect that there'd be invitations to go and stay with a friend in their home at the weekend on a Saturday night. Uh, we encourage this and we see it as a wonderful opportunity. We'd always talk to you about these plans beforehand. And exactly the same is true for their travel to and from school at the start or end of term, for half terms and exeat weekends. We'd always talk to you about travel arrangements so that we're sure we're keeping them safe and looking after them as you would, checking they'd have everything they need for the journey, their passport perhaps. And it's very easy for us to help arrange transport to and from the airport. Stansted Airport is so close. Now we don't insist that every pupil leaves for Exeat weekends, although many choose to. We always leave at least one boarding house open for those that wish to stay in. Now the most important thing for us is the pastoral care that we provide. The way that we look after our pupils here, understanding the challenges that they face. We want to help them develop their character and their nature, to become people who take responsibility who show resilience when things are not straightforward and who show resourcefulness in approaching new challenges. Now we try to think carefully about providing the right environment for them to be successful so that they feel safe, secure and at home. They're able to personalise their own boarding space to an extent, able to influence the activities that they're involved in. They're given the right balance of directed and undirected time, a healthy balance of academic co-curricular and the all-important relaxation time that teenagers need. But going further than that, all our boarding staff work closely as well with teachers in the EAL department so that we're properly aware of language issues 
And we even try to make the most of the cultural diversity in the school and each boarding house through social events and celebrations. A welcoming, supportive, inclusive community environment that encompasses families as well and enables students to thrive. That is boarding at Felstead.